Hello everyone, Carson here, and in today's video, I'm going to be comparing Bluehost and HostGator, and the major differences and the similarities between these two platforms, as well as which one you should go with if you're looking for a hosting plan. Before we do get into this video though, just a reminder that I have a link in the description where you can check out both of these platforms and receive special discounts if you want to pick them out. So with that out of the way, remember to leave a like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell, and let's get into the video. Now, both Bluehost and HostGator are leading names in the hosting industry. They're both incredibly popular, and they also power over 10 million domains, respectively. Now, the first thing I want to compare is the similarities between the platforms, because they both offer over 99% uptime, super great customer support, and similar page speed and loading times. So in those categories, Bluehost and HostGator are really, really similar. You're not going to be finding too many differences. Both Bluehost and HostGator have very good loading times, Bluehost hovering around 729 and HostGator hovering around 700, which is just incredibly good for both platforms and there isn't really going to be a visible difference to your user no matter which platform you go with. Now in terms of uptime, both Bluehost and HostGator offer 99.99% .99 uptime, which is really incredible and anyone who's looking for uptime, this is definitely the thing for you. You're not going to be really finding much better uptime unless you're looking at a platform with other major downsides and things like that. So in uptime categories, both of these hosting platforms smash it into the ground. Now, both of these platforms also offer a wide variety of different hosting plans, including shared hosting, dedicated hosting, VPS hosting, and WordPress hosting. Now, overall, both of these companies going head to head is actually extremely close. They both provide such similar features that it's hard to make a distinction between them because they are both top website hosting platforms in the market today. You're not going to be finding a lot of distinctions, but there are a few, and that's what I'm going to kind of explain now. Overall, I would actually say that Bluehost offers a wider variety of plans, a wider variety of features, and and just overall is easier to use. Although they are so incredibly similar, and I actually highly recommend both platforms, I think in this comparison, because I have to make a decision, I'm gonna give it to Bluehost. But that is going to do it for today's video, so remember to leave a like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell because I upload all the time and you don't want to miss out in case I do any giveaways or in case I have any coupon codes or special offers for you. So remember to do that and also just a reminder that I have a link right now in the description where you can check out Bluehost and HostGator and receive special discounts. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.